I'm going to talk to you about a disappointing thing about solar charging a Bosch e-bike battery. I kind of suspected that there was something fishy about a Bosch e-bike battery when I couldn't get any voltage reading from a fully charged battery. Another thing I found odd is that my dealer knew of no way I could order a connector that would allow connecting the battery to a source of power other than the Bosch charger. Furthermore, when I searched the internet for information on how to connect a Bosch Power Pack 400 to a solar panel, there was no information to be found. So I contacted the company by email. I got a response from Martin Willey of the Automotive Electronics e-bike service. What he suggested was that I feed the power from my solar panel through a controller to a 12 volt battery and then convert the 12 volt DC power to 110 AC with a pure sine wave inverter. And then I could charge the battery with the regular charger that came with my e-bike. And that would be a very complicated system. I responded to him that I had thought of that, but had rejected the idea because of the inefficiency losses and the extra weight that all this equipment, including a large 12 volt battery would entail. So I sent him another email asking him specifically which MPPT boost controller I should buy and where I could get a connector for the battery. He kindly did respond to this more specific request. He said that the connector is only available from Bosch, but it's not sold separately. Furthermore, he couldn't help me because they have no experience in that field, which, and he added, when there is a topic about which we don't have experience, we don't provide any opinion, which is understandable, I suppose. So. It has become evident that the electronics that regulate how a Bosch e-bike battery works prevents the battery from being charged by anything else than the charger that comes with the bike. In my case, that isn't so serious. In fact, I was thinking that the bicycle camper that I'm currently building wouldn't be equipped with a range extender solar panel, like the trailer that I built last year. I came to the conclusion that it's much more efficient to simply buy a third battery than messing about with a solar charging system that is insufficient to make me independent from the power grid. I'm now of the opinion that if you're going to bother with solar power for your e-bike, you might as well get enough power to be completely independent. And at the latitude of southern Canada, that means a 300 watt solar array or more. If you know of anybody who has found a simple way to charge a Bosch e-bike battery from a solar panel, please let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching.